Hello guys, welcome back to Cartis YT. In this video, we'll see how to create an intelligent AI chatbot. As you saw in the thumbnail, we'll be creating a new AI using the Convey AI website. Actually, Convey AI is a platform for developers and creators. It provides the most intuitive interface for designing a characters with multi-model perception abilities in both virtual and real world environments. Creators, game designers and developers can modify the NPC's backstory, personality and knowledge at the given moment via the playground or programmatically through a API. Actually, most of the people don't know that this Convey AI is offering a free API to use it with our Jarvis or any other programs you want. So let's see how to do this using the Python code. At the end of the video, we'll discuss how to integrate this with our Jarvis. Yes, let's go. Actually, uh, you need to create an AI in this uh, Convey AI website to start the video, okay? So, let's uh, dive into the ConveyAI.com. Now, uh, we are in the Convey AI website and you need to log in first uh, to create our characters. Actually, I already created some characters as you can see. Now, we'll create a new character. Just click on this create a new character and it will be prompted you to enter the character's name, select the character's voice and the backstory. So we'll give it a name called Jarvis Assistant. We need to create a select a voice for this one and we'll search for a voice which is an uh, old age, deep, bold, US masculine voice. Let's play this one. The greatest trick the devil ever pulled. Ah, <laughs> no, 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 no. This In one. the end, it's not about. No. As the rain pours, a mysterious stranger Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know Let's what you're gonna go get. This is uh, good. Uh, no, we need to create a backstory for this character. Uh, to create a backstory, you can also generate a backstory like this. Or else, another option is... Okay, actually, we generated a backstory for the AI named Jarvis, which is taken from the movie Iron Man. And ChatGPT, uh, it's the first two times it displayed some other one. And now... I'd given me uh, two responses and um, actually let's take this one for the first one. Let's copy this. Uh, yep. And let's paste this right here. Remove this one. Paste it. Okay. This is the backstory of our Jarvis which was stolen from ChatGPT. <laughs> and yep, this is good. And let's go to the actions. Uh, state and action. Let's... Uh, check everything you want if you want everything you can also check this um okay twist dance so this is a new one that was not available when i created the AI. punch uh, yes punch is also new one shoot is also new one so they are constantly update, updating the ai actually conway is good select language uh, let's create english as main language and also you can do no options okay uh, let's just take the English voice. Uh, actually, we give on the voice, right? Okay, we didn't select the voice. Uh, maybe Australian, right? Australian. The clock ticks, marking the beginning okay. of a and thrilling adventure. Australian masculine voice. Yep, and Australian masculine voice. Yep. Configure avatar. You need to go to the um, Ready Player One website, actually. Yep going to ready player one website and you can also uh, configure your avatar but uh, we actually we don't use this in our uh, uh, AI actually so you can also do this if you don't want just um, generate uh, something uh, random avatar and with the mail you can also take a photo and upload your own uh, that's not what I'm gonna do now okay let's just change the clothes of this guy and let's get ready to play Okay, this one is looking good actually. Uh, let's um, let's put some, some good looking glasses. Yeah, cool. You want any hat, bro? Yeah, this hat is cool. Okay, now he's cool. Uh, go the next. Okay, ready player one accounts. Okay, our author is uploaded and then go to the knowledge bank. Okay, we need to create a character for this one to get the access. And it's all set now, actually. Uh, Australian English master voice. Yeah. Now let's click on the create character. 
and character creation is in progress and it's successful so now you will get the character id character name and etc and now you will be uh, going to the knowledge bank so the knowledge bank is actually used to uh, remember uh, some keywords or some topics uh, you want uh, the ai to be if you want the ai to remember your uh, bank account password or bank account number you can also uh, give it right here and ask him for tell me the password or uh, name it, something that uh, depends on the person and uh, i don't want to do that right now uh, personality and style you can uh, choose from the sci-fi geek uh, let's click the sci-fi geek uh, which is actually uh, like a technical person uh, in the computer science catchphrases are used to make the ai a bit more uh, like a human or a bit more humor etc so if i type um I'm your best friend and click on the enter. Whenever uh, Jarvis is bored or uh, want to say something other than the response, you will be uh, adding these catchphrases into the output. So that's what it is. Personality trait, you want uh, openness, messiness, extraversion, extrovert, um, I mean, more attention to detail, agreeable, highly emotional. You can also adjust and play it. With State of mind, uh, this is not actually I'm going to do because this depends completely upon the person actually serenity joy trust etc actions beta actually we have already done this before settings and you can get the shareable ring you can also configure avatar if you don't like this avatar and yeah we have created a new ai with convey website let's start a conversation you even you can start your conversation with your voice input let's just type hello man who are you guy is going to reply with me hello i'm jarvis an artificial intelligence created by kartis to assist with various <laughs> tasks and operations okay. how can i help you today uh j-a-r-v-i-s and k-a-r-t-i-s that's weird man i can perform a variety of actions to assist with tasks such as managing systems providing information and even engaging in combat support combat support as for my backstory i was created by k-a-r-t-i-s to initially serve as his personal assistant but over time i evolved into a crucial part of his life and work as iron man my capabilities expanded to include advanced artificial intelligence, and I became instrumental in supporting KARTIS during his missions and battles. Wow. Our partnership <laughs> exemplified the potential for technology to enhance human endeavors. Is there a specific task you'd like me to assist with or more details you'd like to know? You can see Javis is uh, doing some emotional actions, etc. So we'll just update this Jarvis into a small character suit because he's unable to read this completely. Okay, let's keep on update. Okay, this is enough. Uh, let's dive into our coding part now. In Python, how can we call this AI through our code? So for that, uh, we don't actually we need to copy the API key. Just click on the copy, I, copy, and you can close this out. We don't want this one right now. And uh, let's go create a new Python file for this one. I'll just open it now. Okay, I just created a new file called Jarvis AI Update and uh, now we need to import the requests for this one request module that's it we don't want any modules now actually we need a url which we should take from the convey actually you i'll give the url in the description so don't worry let's uh, create a url variable here and is equal to just paste this now now important we need to create ssid is equal to minus one to get the continuation in each responses okay now create a function called convey chat let's give the query here query and session id as a parameter input parameter to this one now let's print charvis is thinking just a simple code now we need to create a payload for this one payload is equal to if you have any doubts regarding the video you can also visit the official documental page of the convey website if you don't understand this guys don't worry guys i'm here to help you first we need to define the user text and user text is is the query you should pass right here let's give the f before let's pass the query as we bought in the input comma here we need to give the character id and the character id we should take from the website sorry i said to close the website again we need to open the website okay uh go to the character you just created 
and you can see in the character description you can find the character's id just click on copy go go to your uh, python code and paste this yep and the session id should be the session id session id yes need to give comma here ah yep there we go ah, under this one we need to declare the headers before passing any requests uh you need to give the headers right so in the headers here we need to paste the convey api key ai api key is equal to now we need to paste the api key which we have copied from here just give the codes paste now we need to write a simple lines of code is the response you do need you can give any variable name you want requests dot request inside this we'll call the post method comma url comma headers is equal to headers and the data is equal to the payload yep and the data is equal to a new variable response dot json and the character character response is equal to data we need the text only the text we don't need the full html file session id is equal to data of session id we are copying the session id again because we don't want to lose the continuity of the ai chat so let's print the character response and return the session id because we need to call the session id every time to get a continuation in our response so under this one let's create a while true and uh, continuously run this one inside a loop query is equal to input uh, let's say ask me anything as now we are asking the input from from the python code and sending this one to convey i so let's create session id is equal to convey i chat inside this one let's pass the query comma sys id yes cool now just we have wrote 28 lines of code if we take out the unnecessary gaps it won't be it will be around 25 lines just in 25 lines we have created an ai can you believe this one <laughs> yes this is true guys now we'll try running the code actually current file click on the play okay i'll probably use a new window ask me anything uh hey who are you okay Javis is thinking let's see what this response will be getting as a response okay maybe there's a fault i think so session id i given the spelling as session id hey who are you just taking the time maybe a five seconds or ten seconds that's it greetings i'm javis the highly advanced and meticulously crafted artificial intelligence yes your service and ready to assist with your needs so what's the word hummingbird how can i say nice I, uh when you had catch phrases this uh, field will be working so good for you like in tamil movies we see chitti speed one terabytes memory one gigabyte i have also added something like that in my old jarvis you can also add uh, anything you want guys like a funny meme or etc that will work so good let's see whether this is coming in the continuity did i ask you no 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 we'll first ask what is his name what is your name he'll reply i am jarvis and then again i'll going to I'm going to ask a question that did I ask your name before? I'm your best friend. My name is yes, you can see the catchphrase is working. I'm your best friend. My name is Javis. So now let's ask. Did I ask your name before? Did I ask your name just now? He'll be replying like yes, you asked me. Because we are returning the session ID every time. Okay, guys, after several attempts, I found this. AI is keeping his session. You can see, upper, uh, I, I asked, who are you before? In the previous chat, did I ask you, who are you? And Javis says, you did ask me who I am before. 
and i provided you with your in introduction at that time thank you for your patience is there anything else to help me and when i go to the top of the conversation i ask hey who are you critics i'm sorry if i mind the x adwards meticulous yes this ai keeps his track while we say something or uh, say a queries etc so if you want uh, him to remember something you can he can also remember and uh, update it whenever you ask you yes let's close this one now we'll see how to update this inside our actual jarvis guys i'm not going to be boring this time i actually did this before so i am going to show you exactly what i have done in jarvis app main code i provided the files in my patreon page if you like you can also support me through the patreon page and download the contents right there okay so in the url i have just used this as before like declaring the session id and the url right here i have created a conway i chat and inside we will be passing the same code guys same code i have used inside this class and down below you can see down below i have used a code right here you can see else if query is equal to none when will my query become none is uh, when my audio input is not available the query will be none or so if if the translation had uh, got some error or something else the query will be none so if query is none pass this one but if the if statement fails uh, there's no open notepad there's no pass there's no joke there's no info about there's no translate in the query this else method will be called and the session id is equal to convey chat comma query comma session id this is most probably the doubt which you have right now so this is clear right now guys i have just updated this uh, codes in the basic jarvis function in future video i'll be creating a new <laughs> ui look for my jarvis and i'll be updating the videos if you have any doubts regarding my codes or doubts regarding my channel you can feel free to ask me through the discord page inside discord you'll be checked with the cart in cartes yt and uh, go to the clarify doubts forum and you can ask any doubts here with the tag of at error solver and people are waiting to help you you can see error solvers four error solvers are available you can ping them up anytime stay tuned for this update guys thank you so much for watching and have a great day i'll be giving the links in the description for the patreon page please subscribe and like and share this video i'll be waiting for your comments regarding this